So guys, in this video today, I'm going to be telling you how you can start your fat loss transformation and I'm going to be telling you everything that you need to know in order to start a transformation and even achieve a transformation or even better how I did. I'm going to be showing you my transformation right now. So as you can see, I was very overweight and I would say quite like chubby and had love handles, back fat, chest fat, belly fat, all these things that you can call it. And then I slowly over the weeks got leaner and leaner and leaner and after the nine days I got ripped and shredded. And the thing is, I actually knew I was gonna get shredded and I knew how I would look. So I wanna tell you guys how you can do it. So subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram. And if you wanna get ripped and shredded in only 90 days, click the first link in the bio and let's get you onto a 90 day shredding plan. This is a program which is designed to get you ripped and shredded in only 90 days. It's worked for me, it's worked for thousands of people around the world, including my brother. And it is a program for you to achieve that shredded physique that you always have wanted. But let's get talking about how you can start your transformation and get that ripped and shredded physique that you always have wanted. So the first thing is now you got to have a goal and you got to know how you are going to look because if you have never actually got shredded and you know seen your abs before it's hard for you to actually visualize like a set of abs on your stomach and you don't know like how you are even going to look now if you are in this position I want you to just simply visualize you having abs and you say to yourself this is how I'm going to look now it could even mean that you look up to someone and this is how I'm gonna look and you know visualize yourself don't have a like unrealistic goal for example myself I'm trying to look like Phil Heath because that, that's never gonna happen if you means that you want to look like myself for example or you want to look like an athlete someone who is very realistic look up to that person and have a goal and say to yourself this is how I'm going to look when I get ripped and shredded because it'll give you like a set of mindset knowing that this is how I'm going to be looking like if you have done it before you will know then how you will look but this time even better when you drop the body fat and get lean so that's the first thing I'm going to definitely advise you guys have a goal and know exactly how you want to look now the next point is you got to track your progress and when I mean track your progress I'm not saying like write down your weight and how many sets and reps you're doing what I'm saying is have a short-term goal if it means like it's a Monday today take a picture without a shirt of course so you can see your physique and then two weeks later or even a week later you keep on taking a photo so you know exactly how you have progressed this week or even over the last two weeks because if you don't know where you started how you're progressing if it's with your body weight your physique in the mirror even if you want you can track your progress in the gym how much you're lifting what exercises you're doing but all of that is done on the 90 day shredding plan i want you guys to track these small things so you can always look back the days where you feel demotivated because them days will come is natural i would say i get at least two of them days every week where i feel like you know what? i don't want to go to the gym but i visualize myself how i want to look what's my goal and how I progressed over the weeks and these things push me to say you know what let's just get it done track your progress that is a must something else I want you to do is take everything week by week and this is something which I related to what I just said don't just look at like 12 weeks 90 days thinking that you know what this is how I'm going to look and that's it it's good having that but just break it down and take everything week by week okay cool week one done boom let's go again take everything week by week comes again another week another week another week just keep going keep going keep going and by the end of it you'll say you know what it's week eight at the minute like i just said look at week one how i started you know i've actually made a significant amount of progress over the week so break it down and believe me you'll stay motivated that way because motivation is everything if your motivation goes out the window then you won't know exactly what to do but the motivation the workout the diet what to do in the gym everything is done on the 90 day shredding plan and also you're gonna be having 24 7 support to me someone who's got ripped and shredded someone who's been chubby fat and like very insecure at times about his physique and over the weeks he's got lean and this is a program which i've created as well and like i said work for thousands of people around the world so click the link in the bar if you're serious only about transforming your physique in only 90 days now when it comes to fat loss it is not a must but i will advise everyone including my clients as well do some sort of cardio in order to help you achieve your goal to get ripped because what cardio does is it simply burns calories and allows you to have more food of course now let's say your maintenance calories is 2300 calories and you burn this is 300 calories you're down to 2000 calories so it actually takes away 
your calories in your day and there's so many benefits of cardio you can do hit cardio where you're sprinting for one minute and uh, going for a walk and do this maybe for 20 minutes so you're doing 10 rounds or simply you can go on the cross trainer treadmill go for a walk and these kind of things are also a good source of cardio and also going to be burning calories and this is now called list cardio so make sure you're including both of these cardios in your workout program don't just do hit every day because it's very taxing on your body now make sure you are doing weight training in your program because weight training burns a lot of calories it also gives shape to your body as well because you just don't want to lose the fat and then when you lose the fat you're thinking that oh my god you know like i don't really have much of a chest i don't have much of our arms and you know there's not much shape to your body and then what happens is you start looking up how to lose the whole you know skinny fat look and our skinny fat look is where you simply have very skinny arms have a belly and you don't really have a lot of muscle mass but you still have fat on your body now for example myself like I have a little bit of muscle mass, but if I was to lose majority of my muscle mass and keep the fat which I have on at the minute, just a little bit of fat, I will be like the whole like skinny fat look because even when I'm like fairly lean as you see in the pictures, just because I look like that, that does not mean I'm like ripped and shredded and not much fat on me. There is a, still a little bit of fat, but because I have a okay-ish amount of muscle mass, it actually kind of fills out the fat and it makes me look a lot more leaner. Make sure you're following a healthy balanced diet. Now make sure you're having a protein, carbohydrates and fats as well. When it comes to the diet, let's say week one you haven't lost weight and you're consuming this many calories, reduce the calories next week to 200 calories less and then you'll come to a point saying, you know what, this is how many calories I need in order to lose weight and this is how many calories I need to eat. And then slowly over the week to slowly reduce your calories. So consume as many calories as possible losing weight at the start slowly 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 come down if you start low calories at the start you will lose fat at the start then eventually you'll plateau because your body is used to eating x amount of calories and then what happens is it can even result into the whole metabolic damage where you're eating like 1100 calories maybe even lower than that and you feel like absolute crap and you're not losing weight it's playing with your head because you're not losing weight you're thinking what the hell is going on man i need to fix this let me consume like one meal a day and it just becomes absolute mess it affects your whole day and it's a struggle so what you need to do then is that's like a separate video but i might as well break it down to you as quick as i can you need to slowly increase your calories give yourself like six weeks or eight weeks don't worry about fat loss too much over this phase. Just slowly get your calories back up. And when you feel healthy, you're now consuming a good amount of calories, then slowly come back down again. Okay, that's how you're going to fix that. But I can make another video in the future how you can really tackle the situation and avoid it as well. That's something that you don't want to get yourself into. Something else I want to talk about now is social media. Now, social media is great for looking up to people and having a goal that's how you want to look for example but something which does affect a lot of people and i think this is more for women and also for men as well because what we tend to do is we start comparing ourselves having this goal to lose fat we're doing excellent with ourselves and our progression then all of a sudden we start looking at photos on instagram of other men that is just shred to the bone and it's good if you use that as motivation but what a lot of us do is we start comparing their own lives to them particular people you start saying to yourself you know what am i doing if you start feeling demotivated because you, you say to yourself oh look how lean he is how muscular is. you know all these things start going through your head and women do it a lot and i think men do it as well a lot where you start comparing yourselves and it really does put you down so i want you to use social media somewhere where you can gain motivation but never compare yourself to someone else because so and so might be trained for the last 20 years and you could be in your first year or even in your first couple of weeks so never compare yourself and i know you may not do it or maybe you do but i just thought i'd tell you guys because that is something which i can guarantee a lot of us at some point in our life will do that if it's not with fitness if it's with a job or school where you compare yourself to other people never do that okay that's something i want to tell you guys so i hope you all have enjoyed this video if you want to get ripped and shredded in 90 days like i said click the first link in the bio let's get you onto the 90 day shredding plan this is a program which is designed to get you ripped and shredded in only 90 days boys and girls hope you all have enjoyed this video and i shall see you all in the next video peace